Hard luck today, beaten by Moorfield 2-13 to 2-7 in the Leinster Club semi-final. I imagine having beaten Club Royalty in the shape of St Vincent's, you're disappointed not to have got to the final, not to have won in what is essentially a home patch in Ockram. Yeah, we're devastated. Um, look, we probably came up short. Moorfield were the better team, I think, on the day, but it um, doesn't really soften the blow. We thought we were getting to a Leinster final. We tried our hardest, tried our damnedest, but a um, few costly errors there where we were chasing the game and Moorfield punished us. But they're, they're good, good value for the win, Morfield. In the second half, they simply found scores easier to come by. Yeah, definitely. Um, they moved the ball pretty well into their full forward line and a couple of sharpshooters in there. We probably didn't give our defence enough of a kind of, of a dig out. We were, we were pushing on. We were always trying to cat, play and catch up and that can be difficult at times. But um, when the scores pre- presented themselves, they, they took them. So fair play to them. And for much of this team, you kind of can't lay it down and lick your wounds can you you're involved in the Leinster Intermediate Club hurling final next week against Bally Ragged. I imagine that's a really great thing that's a, that's a blessing to have something yeah. to look, up, look forward to straight away well that's, there's five of us involved now with Glenelly next week playing Bally Ragged. we're going down there um, for a Leinster final um, so we have to pick ourselves up the rest of the lads will, will be down but um, there's no we can't be licking our wounds we have to just get back on the horses to say and try to give that a rattle next week and a lot of people that are here today supporting the football will be in Kilkenny next week and um, so look it's fantastic to be playing football this time of the year and hurling for um, in the club in the club scene and um, look keeps people happy gets people out of the house on winter days and look even though we we're beaten today we had a fantastic year with a great win against Vincent's um, a good one against Newtown Blues. We won a championship. So, like, happy days, OK? We're not in the Leinster final, but pick yourself up, dust yourself off and go again. I imagine Andy Club will take a county title if offered at the start of the year. Uh, just before I let you go, playing in Nolan Park against Bally Ragged next week, I mean, it's away from home, but it's, it's kind of a good thing in a way because that's a hurling amphitheatre. And for clubs like Glen Ely and players in Wicklow, they love when they get to play in these kind of stages because it's not something they often get to do. Yeah, 100%. And look, ask any player. When you get to that level or you're playing in an arena, like, or if you get to an Olin Park or a Crow Park, like an extra 10 or 15% comes across you as a player. Like it comes out of you, um, especially if you're from a so-called week or county or, or club. Um, like you rise to it and any player worth his fucking... His, Salt will um, will rise to that, you know. Yeah. Make with that. <laughs> <laughs> it's the internet, so we can play whatever we want. Leighton, best of luck next week. Hard luck today, yeah, and uh, best of luck as I say next weekend. Cheers, lad. Thanks.